And that breaking news, Lakeland police are searching for suspects after 10 people were hurt in a shooting. This happened just before 4 o'clock this afternoon. West Street tonight, Gabriel Gettigas joins us live from that scene tonight. Tonight, you spoke to parents who were picking up their kids from the bus stop when this all happened. That's right. You know, a crowd of people was outside here this afternoon when a car drove by. Lakeland police say the driver didn't stop, and suddenly the people inside rolled all four windows down and started shooting. Ten people were hurt. All of this happened when a school bus had just dropped off some children. It just like get in the house, duck. We don't know what's going on. And you just heard I'm, I'm been hit. Neighbor. I've been hit. People running. A school bus stopped to drop off kids between Iowa and Plum Street in Lakeland Monday afternoon when moments later gunshots flew everywhere. It's a blessing. No, not not one kid got shot. That is an absolute blessing. Yeah, absolute I was blessing. Weird. You have kids of your own? Yeah, they were getting off the bus. They're seven and nine. Lakeland Police Chief Sam Taylor says 10 people were hurt. Two of them are in critical condition. He says some people were standing outside when suddenly a dark blue four door Nissan came driving by. The vehicle slowed, it did not stop, and the four windows went down. It appears it was occupied by four shooters in the vehicle and they started firing from all four windows of the vehicle. Officials say the car then sped away. When police got there, they found three people hurt and later learned that the other eight victims made it to the hospital with the help of others or on their own. We have reason to believe that this was a targeted event, that it was not a random act. Um, we did locate a quantity of marijuana at the scene, which would indicate that um, obviously there were some narcotic sales or sales of marijuana going on at the time. Officials are not yet sure if the marijuana was connected to the shooting. They found two guns so far, but they're still looking for the shooters. When stuff like this happens, you know, it, it just kind of hits home with me a little bit that, uh, you know, maybe we're not a small town anymore. And it, it actually is pretty sad. We don't know what the real coming to. Everyone has to stay prayed up, know God, right. take everything to him, you know, and watch your surroundings the best you can. We're told all the victims are men. Lakeland police need your help finding the car. Once again, it's a dark blue four door Nissan with tinted windows and a temporary license plate. If you know anything about this shooting, please give police a call. Reporting live in Polk County, Sanai Gabrigadigas, Washington News.